Hello everybody, welcome to Season 46 second round match between Hellboy and his Dark Elves and Baza Castine and his Amazons. In the booth with me is Fymir and Artemis. Hello! Hello! Here we are. This uh, game is going to be a rough call for the Amazons, but they have Hail Mary Pass. <laughs> and this team own us a Hail Mary Pass. Because I remember the first uh, round. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he and nearly they didn't did a Hail Mary Pass. Oh, so it's it's bugged out. He's got a wizard. Uh, he has a banter. wizard. A wizard, a babe, yeah. and Roxana. Okay, that's that's a lot of inducements. Mm. Fourteen players versus thirteen. I mean, yeah. End of the day, a wizard and Roxanne can win you the game. Can get get the uh, get you the game. So. Yeah. Two and four. Yeah, and these these dark elves are a little bit bloody. They've got all the stats. Yep, yep, lots of stats, only one Very tackle. high TV. Yep. Deep bench. So, yeah. Wait, he forgot the ball. He literally Holy forgot the ball. Holy shit! Amazing. He, he literally forgot the ball. Full, full Rick mod. Amazing. Amazing. And he's failed the GFI on there as well. <laughs> oh my so, god. Yeah. This is, maybe Vasa was, uh, you know, uh, been a, a walk for... Two days or something like that. When, like, when he tried to qualify. Yeah, yeah, that was a bit of a bit of a pickle, there, wasn't he? <laughs> it's like, oopsie. <laughs> and could he not even have reached? Could he not have reached one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine? I guess he can't now. Shame. No. All those movement ups, and he's still too far away. Yeah. To be fair, that's a bit of a weakness of the rule of five as well, isn't it? Like there wasn't, there wasn't a lot of pressure on a failed, a failed pickup and stuff. <laughs> that was a little bit more. What's <laughs> <laughs> not a pressure if you have like immediate aneurysm? <laughs> yes. <laughs> and now, yes. I mean, I think the only sensible thing to do. Carry on! There's only one play. diamond tackle, isn't there? So, yeah. Just shame concede, maybe? <laughs> Both coaches had forgotten the ball up to turn five and not put it on the pitch. Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's next level. <laughs> I'm gonna go and find uh, my favorite clip. That's why I said it was full Rick. I'll go find it while uh, this turn's playing out. Yes, yeah, the amazing, the amazing Rick player. Ah, Rick's life! <laughs> Freaked me out. <laughs> <laughs> well, then, then they get a pass. I mean, that's a classic mistake of very new players. I mean, because you know, they blue will have a lot of stuff going on. Yeah. I mean, the ball is wow, but you know, when even in a final of the enough tournament, the player uh, puts 12 players on the pitch instead of 11. Yeah. Glorious, yeah. Yeah, wizarding yourself. I mean, you can't really do that in tabletop, can you? But, um, in football. I guess you can't fail to pick up the ball in tabletop either. Yeah, that was, that was great, the Rick one. This is looking like a pretty good screen. <laughs> yeah, if you blow it up, you can literally just see me mocking him in the top left with the chat coming up. <laughs> like, I think at some point I'm like, this is going to be hilarious when he actually reads chat. <laughs> <laughs> well, the ball is gone. The Arch 5 has leapt in, probably. And uh, <laughs> dodged in. Le he leaped in, he got the ball. Wow, instant Roxana things. Oof. <laughs> He's counting the squares, saying the ball save. Yeah, that's a great clip. <laughs> yeah, that's really good. Oh my god. The oh my god. Incredible. 
Oh, let's drop that now, McNaughton. It's all all water under the bridge. This is looking this is looking real bad for the Zons, isn't it? It's almost like picking up the ball and getting into a cage on turn one would have been a good idea. <laughs> really struggling to to get back into it, isn't he? And Roxy's a terrible character to have the ball on because she hasn't. There is a G5 Leaper there waiting. Extreme four waiting for uh... Is this is something, guys? How many guards? Quite a lot. Three, four. Only three guards for the Dells. I kind of. I Only three. Thought, I thought there'd be more. Yeah. <laughs> like I knew there was a lot. He's just gone straight in. Oh, hello. I don't really like leaping for the one one of there, to be honest. I would have rather just played properly for another turn, but don't want to. I mean, this a uh, decent uh, amount of dark elves in the general area, so it's all right. Yeah, it's all right, but. And Roxanne can be very quick, but the other Amazons are not as quick. Yes. Yeah, he wants to get the team back together in one one blob, doesn't he? Yeah, and then get the ball on a blodger. Yeah, that's better. This has cost him so much time and momentum, though. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Like, you know, even even though you know, the ball is safe again, like. That's four turns wasted, and the ball is deep in his own half. Yeah, and yeah, it's, a, it's wrecked it, his drive, yeah. It's a lot of free elves. A lot of untagged elves, free elves. Uh, I mean, it's not... The Amazons don't have that many players. Oh, Volk. Yeah. This is live, I'm watching it in client, and oh my god, it's in weird on this giant monitor. <laughs> Everything's so strange. This is how people play. <laughs> yes, that's a, I have a 34 uh, monitor and another one with a 27, the second yeah. monitor, and that's a yes. Big and well defi defined. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> I mean, play. That's how I check uh, uh, Jimmy's screen. <laughs> Yeah, that's it's real. That's it, like yeah, it's funny. Although he he hasn't obviously hasn't conceded yet, but it has still wrecked his drive, hasn't it? And he's still he's that, still that one in nine. Well, it's not one in nine. He's picked the wrestle. Yep, gonna be a bit of an issue. Yep, you have to, he's gonna have to make. Wait, no, he's not gonna have to make that one in nine dodge because he's just put Roxy there. Hmm. Okay. I guess this one. I guess just get a blitz in again and stick the diving tackle on, forcing him to keep it hitting it. Oh, this doesn't look good. But there are not that many uh, Amazons anyway. I know, Ali, I don't have a 4K uh, screen monitor. <laughs> and they are 2K. I don't like a 4K for uh, gaming. Mm -hmm. I prefer having my juicy 165 Earth. He's not. He's gonna blitz. Surely you should get the. I, I quite like getting the diamond tackle in. Oh, he's is he coming he's for going. a ball hit? He's going in. He's coming for his balls. He likes going for the ball sack, doesn't he? With this H five guy. Yeah. I mean, H5. immediately. <laughs> Got H5, fucked. strength four, leap. Yeah. What a horrible sucker. <laughs> yeah, like he is a really good player, yeah, of course. 
punched that instead of dodged. Yeah. It's not even a. It's not even a bludger. Yeah. He just he likes the ball sack, doesn't he? And now he's managed to make a cage-shaped hole in his defense. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I have to admit, I wasn't expecting this. Oh, hello. Oof. Oof. Close. Wow. Not sure that was that worth getting the tight cage for. Oh, he's going to foul with a dirty play. Okay, okay, okay. So he's just going trying for the high roll. Fair enough. Why didn't he dodge this one down here as well for an assist? Oh, well, oh. never mind. Instant the uh, reward for uh, Hellboy. Yep. Terrible foul. I will never have done that. <laughs> and there's it no guard clear, on clearly, this side. Clearly, it was a poor decision. <laughs> would have broke armor if he'd done the one in nine. There you go. Sucker. <laughs> Doing nothing. This is on, don't you? Let's, yeah. Let's, let's catch it. Yeah. Yeah. Or he could have just stood up that dirty play. I mean, I guess, yeah, fouling it's really, really tempting, isn't it? Okay, fair. here we go again. <laughs> yeah. It's the pow. Oh, disgusting, that. disgusting the pow. full pow. <laughs> oh, nice. Look at our Roxy, yeah. Baza should try going AFK for a few turns. <laughs> that might be his best chance. <laughs> Why would you push that one out to the side like that? It makes the dodge forward easier if he needs to move up. Could have pushed him straight back. It's not like he was doing anything. No. No. Oh. Ooh! Cheeky cows. She's got a gain scoring range and there's diving tackle on Roxana, but she can leap. And there's tackle zones around. It's still very tricky, isn't it? I mean, you could just, just leap one square onto the ball and just fuck off with it. Yeah. There's a rackler there ready to get her, isn't there? Yeah, I mean, she's probably going to get sacked. <laughs> There's no, you can't, you can't get the ball and be safe. It's no, it's hard, isn't asking it? Asking a bit much. You'd have to get the ball over there or something, and like, you just can't really screen it or anything, can you? I guess you, this one could dodge, and this one could come up. Has he forgotten about her? Uh, so this one could come up and then and might make a screen over that way, I don't know. Nope, just does the dodge. He just dodged from diamond tackle into a tackle zone as well. Yep. Why well, not? The tackle zone doesn't matter, does it? But well, it, well, it kind of does, yeah. Ten, yeah, it adds does. another, yeah. Yeah, so 75% dodge instead of 83% lead. Silly boy. <laughs> Would have expected better from Baza. Yeah, so he's managed to get he's managed to get a screen. Roxana. I mean Ish. It's, a, Ish. It's, a, it's, a, it's not insanely difficult to make it around that one no, zone. No, no, but at least he's got something, right? At least he got something. Yes, it it's was... not free. Yeah. There we go. It's not a full prepare. It's just easy. Yeah. Well, let's see if uh, Hellboy is able to get uh, some dice on the ball here. <laughs> yeah. It's a test. <laughs> Alive now as well, I've just realised. So it'll take a little bit longer. Nope, oh, he's managed to find the way to get the guard oh. in. 
Whoa. No, 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 he that, should that, put that the other right. guard in there if he's going to hit with the witch, right? Because he's going to he's going to frenzy onto a guard. Yes. So he should put the other guard on this side of the screen. So yes. it's not two into one. Yep. Let's see if he does it. Well, he's just doing other things first, so that's fine. I wonder if he's going to go for the surf. Oh, actually, if he's hitting yeah, with the they... witch, it's a, if unless he cuts the corner, it's a, it's only getting one block anyway. Nine, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, right? Yeah, yeah, good point. I think he might be going for the surf, you know. Really? Oh, he's gonna cut the corner then. He's gonna, yeah, he's gonna cut the corner for the extra dice. What is this? Mm. What? I think he miscounted the squares. Is he is he going for the dodge in surf? And that's yeah, the... the surf, yeah, yeah. I wouldn't be. I wasn't surprised about the surf thing. Yeah, yeah, the surf. Uh, it's, I think it's old. terrible personally because you just get scored on twenty five percent of the time, nearly, don't you? Which is it's not what I would do. Surf from the top. No, I mean he that's can't, can't same dodge. If he still goes round, same yeah. dodge in. Yeah. Just gonna just dodge straight through in that case. Save movement. Yeah, yeah, you, yeah. You can't. One, two, three, four, five, six. Four plus seven, dodge, no matter what you do. GFI, yeah, yeah. So you'd have to make that dodge, or whatever happens. Yeah. Wow. I don't like going for the surf. No, neither do Wait, I. Wait, where's he going? Yeah, he's doing the surf from this end, which is, you know, not what I would do, but. <laughs> <laughs> He re rolled the wow. surfer. Yep. Yep. <laughs> that was a very decided uh, surf. Yeah. And now he has easy peasy. Don't know if I'd have re rolled that. No, I, I would have not. No, no, I think the, the wrestle was good enough. Yeah. Yeah, it was definitely good enough. <laughs> three, three, out of, three out of eight is going in the crowd anyway. Yeah. Like, two, twice it's landing on one of your elves. You don't care about the tackle zone on it because you've got this guy. <laughs> yep. It's now he's going to, yeah, he's going to say he's going to lob the pass. Oh, and never mind, he's just going to roll all the dice and not fail anything. Yep. Amazing reroll. Well done. Uh... <laughs> yeah. Oh, well done. I mean, oh, maybe. Except for that, maybe... Except for that random hand off at the end. Yeah, maybe the reroll uh, was, was that a thing? Uh, gave him, you know, thinking he was going to surf, give him more chances of the ball ending in a positive uh, square to be able to make this play. But the ball could have been also go outside of the pitch with a wrestle result, so... To be fair, Roxy's got jump up, right? So she would have been able to recover herself if something Just went wrong. Just straight in and pick the ball up. Wow. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> what is the Helmery Pass? What is the Helmery Pass? God damn it! <laughs> Deny it again. Wait, what? Wait. Okay. I mean, I guess he got to roll a 6 plus, right? So. Let's just keep in it. Just randomly walked in and went for the ball pickup. Easy. I liked hitting, but... but then I guess you put guard on him and it's not good, is it? So yeah, maybe it was right to not punch him, but he just dodges. Well, now he's got something. Yeah, this is pretty good, isn't it, to be fair? Plus four, plus six, plus. Oh, two plus, four plus, two plus, six plus. You have to make a second dodge, or you're going to be tagged. Yeah. 
he could have needed it for the recovery. Yeah, yeah, the recovery. So, and like he got the ball down. Like it's pretty greedy to re-roll for the surf, isn't it? Like it is. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, that it's not terrible. The only, the, the only, yeah, the only thing in defense of it is that Roxy can still score from the ground there on a wrestle. Yeah. Yeah. But with the re-roll in hand, you're almost certainly getting the ball yourself anyway. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, but it, like it's not terrible, is it? And that's the thing. All the things that get criticised and stuff are, are often not really terrible, right? It's just. Oh, and also there was the chance of getting rid of uh, Roxanne for the rest of the game. Exactly. Yeah, the auto injury is pretty good, isn't it? I yeah, would have kept. I would have kept the ball on that blitzer though. Forced, forced uh, Hellboy to sack it. Yes. Yeah, me too. Especially as he's got sidestep and you can move away from the zones. Except when they are terrible. Uh, uphill and surf the ball. <laughs> yeah, maybe that's the bet. Maybe that's better because then it's a three plus to get it off him instead of a six to get it off him. Oh, so close. Yeah. Early there. Yeah, maybe uh, the uphill yeah. and yeah, surf. Yeah, the early man. That's a, a good. Uh, that's a good idea, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I don't, don't know. Tackle or anything, so yeah. Don't know what the actual odds are, but it was it was a, a good idea, good shot. Yeah, I saw that. Mm. I agree with the, the scattering the crowd uh, being uh, good, but with a wrestle, the ball could have ended also ended in the crowd. Yeah, yeah. Half the time it's in the crowd anyway, more or less. And then you've still got a reroll for the recovery, or whatever. End of the day, the. I mean, the reward of uh, something Roxanne yes. could be really, really good. But then there is the risk of the double skull, <laughs> which is yes. really bad. Um, so, you know, it just is what it is, isn't it? It wasn't terrible or anything. It was just... Uh... No, it could be, you know, a debate about it. I, uh, the... I don't see it as bad at all. No, no, yeah. Both of them are very good uh, points. I don't think it was bad. I just wouldn't have done it. <laughs> uh, Dio did take his arms to Chalice. Yes. But didn't took them very far. Yep. He, uh, he lost in the second round. Um, spoilers. <laughs> do you do you have... Re I like that you've got eight r rules of rerolls, J5. Holy shit. How many how many rules are there for J5's rule of rule of uh, reroll? It's only it's only that one. Call the number eight, you know, to make it look like there is more. Yeah, that's what I imagine. Knowing J5, <laughs> I imagine that's the only rule. Oh wow! Oh wow! There there are more than one. There are eight rules. Oh wow! This is. This is going to be amazing. <laughs> the first run of J5. Run of free rolls. Don't talk. Yeah, so this isn't that terrible for Bazar. He's still got the wizard option, hasn't he? Obviously, he didn't get scored on, which which looked very dangerous after forgetting to pick up the ball. <laughs> That'd be amazing, guys. <laughs> what, a, what a thing to do. Um, so yeah, like you know, for for an offense where you haven't picked up the ball, that that's pretty good, isn't it? Oh, man. Wow, reroll any block with mighty blow that isn't a knockdown. There's no guarantee you'll you'll need them later. There you go. Reroll any block with tackle against dodge that isn't a knockdown. Reroll any block against AV7 that isn't a knockdown. If last action only if you have block. Reroll any dodge with your best player. If you've rolled three pushes in a row, re-roll the next push no matter what. Well, maybe it's not if you're trying to move in 6-1 turn. If opponent is talking shit during the game, re-roll everything that isn't a knockdown. <laughs> you got a re-roll as a result of a kickoff event. You immediately. Re-roll anything just because you feel oh, I like... I don't like, I don't like this Dark Elf setup. It's weird. Uh, yeah, it is weird, isn't it? What are those two... Guys on the LOS doing off the side. 
I don't know. Uh, punching? They're like maintaining a wide LOS while still getting two DPs. Doesn't matter. It wasn't a blitz. Is this going to be a Daka? We'll see it now. Against a wizard and Roxy? Fuck, I hope not. <laughs> oh, instant. Easy later's on. Because nobody wants to level up, really. Making the Daka less effective. <laughs> oh, hello. Oh, wow. This is going well. Incredibly well, yeah. Carry on! <laughs> Yeah, if we just remove everyone, it's a pretty easy game, isn't it? The help sneeze is not made on this FX. I don't no, I don't think it will either. No mighty blow on this uh, Dark F team. He's used all of his doubles for dodge. Uh, for guard, sorry. Yeah. Which is fine, isn't it? It's okay. I mean, I... Wow, three kills. That's pretty mad. Yeah. He just deletes the LOS with no mighty blow. Yeah. Hang on, that one wasn't. That one actually didn't even have block. What is that guy even doing there, punching? Yeah, yeah. Proper that coaching. Was the, that was the thing I liked least about the LOS was was him not having block. But you know, it is what it is. No tackle, yeah. But I mean, that's still fifty-five percent knockdowns, isn't it? Because they've got block. He just happened to roll powers. Like if he'd if he'd used his block skill, we wouldn't even have noticed it. Yeah. Oh, just sad. Sad hell, boy. Gary and might need a might meet might need a shout after this game. To be honest, after Bass's Bass's turn one play. <laughs> oh dear. And no blitz, no. Does, you don't need to when you make three kills, do you? And you're cowering in fear at Roxana and Wizard. Now he's got the power people, hasn't he? Because everyone left has got Bludge, I think. Well, except Roxana. Oh, and the idiotic Hail Mary player. <laughs> Fucking Hail Mary. A player could win Chalice. He could, kind of. You've got to blitz the edge four, eh? The edge four guard, eh? Because then you're getting to the extra hit. He's not doing that. I think you had to blitz this blitzer in the extra hit. Very cautious against the wizard. I mean, if they took a rock and you know, if you're bringing kickoffs into it, Team Antilla, you could have, uh, you could just have quick snap and get a few more as well, right? Potentially. Oh, 
Jo. Hallo. Hallo. Så, at least, something is going the Amazon's way. Yeah. <laughs> I, don't, I don't hate this setup. Like, it's, you know, the, the wizard play he knows is the only thing that's going to cost him the game now. Yeah. It's, it's like a Dakar, isn't it? It's similar to a Dakar. It's a similar kind of idea. He's not trying to get forward at all. He's just staying here <laughs> to burn turns. But without the horrendous failure state of being right against his end zone. All blodgers up front against the amazing one witch elf who's nowhere near the action. Yeah. Yeah, that's the bad thing about keeping it back for a, a wizard or sack, isn't it? Like, to recover is that. Got no tackle. Not doing anything. Yeah. Could have gone tackle instead of shoe of feet on that blitzer. Yeah. At least you'd have a tackle. Yeah. Could have, could have not taken the movement on the diving tackle one and had tackle on it, and that would be nice too. Yeah. I mean, movement's nice, but you've already got one movement and you've given him sure feet. Yeah. I'm, dive, I'm... Diving tackle, double double whammy. Yeah, I really, I really. Running around with no tackle is really annoying. Yeah, I really don't like this sure feet bother, to be honest. <laughs> I really don't like the sure feet. That blitzer would have been mighty blow tackle for me, so it's fine. Like that double would have been the mighty blow. Yeah. Yeah. A blue chew, I've got no idea what that is, Steve. <laughs> is it like blue waffle? Oh god. I definitely don't want a blue waffle sponsorship. <laughs> I wouldn't mind a Jimmy Fantastic sponsorship, but the problem is, I think if I alerted them to my existence, they might just try and wipe me out. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Immediately hear from their lawyers. <laughs> yeah. So started first. So he's kind of—I think he's making this worse. Yeah. It was fine with like the the sort of chevrons, and he's just fucked about a bit. Yeah. Yeah, I was here first, but it's probably not going to matter if they wanted to do anything, is it? Because they've got money. <laughs> is how... Is how the they, they also works. might have trademarks, in which case it doesn't matter who's there first. It uh, yeah. trademark something But they first. have trademarked Gimme Fantastic as a chocolate brand, not as a... You don't, you don't know what they've trademarked it as. They could, they could have had plans for some amazing streaming empire. <laughs> Yeah. Then Jimmy could change his name legally to Jimmy Fantastic, and that's it. There you go. I nearly did, you know, I thought about it. I have found out how much it would cost. <laughs> Surprisingly, not that much. Well, Jimmy, let's be glad that you didn't do it. <laughs> I don't know, I thought it'd be pretty funny. I thought it'd be pretty funny just to be called Jimmy Fantastic. <laughs> And yeah, it's like it's super cheap to change your name. I thought it'd be like really expensive, but like it's not. No, no, J Five. I got I got my Jimmy Fantastic account banned off Facebook because it wasn't my. I couldn't. I could didn't produce documents proving it was my real name. Hannes <laughs> 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 Fantastic. <laughs> Good old hammers. Could you could do like the the guy, the Ultimate Warrior, that legally changed his name to Warrior, so the WWE wouldn't tell uh, him anything because he was still being called the Ultimate Warrior. Yeah, yeah. Which is like, what the hell? Yeah. No, yeah, I did do Steve afterwards, but before that, I'd already made a Jimmy Fantastic account so that I could, I could, you know, follow Warhammer type things on, 
on Facebook without alerting uh, my acquaintances to the fact that I was a mega nerd. <laughs> that, oh, wow. is, that is what it was. Like, obviously, my real friends knew I was a mega nerd, but. Um, not. Not. Hey, clearly, do you think one day the, the woman of Darlington <laughs> knew you were a nerd? Exactly, yeah. <laughs> Literally nobody in real life calls me Artemis until I go to a trade show where 99% of people call me Artemis. <laughs> That's mad, J5. Blue check mark. No, that's Twitter, isn't it? The blue check mark. Yes. Yep. I wanted to. I was going to try because there's, there's fucking... There's Team Fantastic on Twitter, and they've like made one post saying Twitter's shit or something in like, in like ten years, and it's like, oh, <laughs> like fuck's sake. But I don't really care that much. I'm still annoyed. I had to use the Artemis Black. Yeah. Literally, the first thing I've ever failed to get Artemis Black on was Twitch. <laughs> Bloody Harry Potter bullshit. <laughs> Oh yeah, 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 Wanger, don't don't say anything. <laughs> this is my friend Volk for go. <laughs> Amazing. Over twenty five years, Artemis Black. I've I've had mm. Ali, and uh, literally three years ago was the first time I've ever failed <laughs> to be able to just get it on some new medium. Happens to some men when they reach uh, middle age. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, he's he's transferring the ball. Always. Yeah, uh, always a risk. Is it? But other people don't roll ones, so it's fine. Yeah. The only time I've ever done well in the cup, I lost the game on a ball transfer. I lost the game on that exact roll. Wow. Snake the handoff. Artemis, where did Artemis got the name? From the Drift Dolden novels, probably. Where did and I get Artem the name from? Uh, Artemis is from Artemis and Treri. Yes, Drift the, 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 There you go. Yeah, the Drift Dolden assassin. It's not the only place I got it, but I liked it. I, he was the person that let me know that it was um, a unisex name. Because before that, obviously, and still now, lots of people only know Artemis from the goddess. Yes. The Greek goddess. So um, so when I had the books, I was like, oh, I didn't know that was a unisex name. I looked it up, and there was a bunch of people called Artemis. And, like, you know, in recent years, there's Artemis Fowl, like the YA series. Oh, that's a dead zone. Yep. Dead good on too, holy shit. Yeah. I like this leap though. I liked I like the blitz and leap to correct this shitty cage. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Basically. Yeah, that is a really good zone. Is Apple already gone? Yeah. Didn't notice it, but Apple's gone. The last name Black comes from uh Lucas Black, who's an actor. You might know him from Fast and the Furious Three Tokyo Drift. <laughs> Oh my god. god. But when when I took the last name Black, he was the little kid in American Gothic, the TV series. Are we and I really liked American Gothic. Wow. Yeah. This is a this is a way to turn. It has yeah. to be really, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah. So there is I mean it's not gonna be a it's not a good wizard turn, but there's not gonna be a better one, so this is it. Yeah. It is Ali, yes. It's pretty mad that he became more known as a comedy actor. But H that's what I first knew him from. HMP can't reach. Sad face. He could, he could, uh, you know, he can't hand off to anyone. I think he can hand off, but he can't. He can't get there and back to HMP, sadly. Mm.
I really don't like that really long pause. That really long pause should have come before the bolt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess so. But I still think, you know, as it is, it's like... It's the wizard turn because you're just not going to get a better chance. Yeah, but I mean, you... <laughs> you have a think about it first, right? You, you yeah, just bolt yeah. and then go, right, what can I do? <laughs> yeah, yeah, maybe. <laughs> you might think, oh, okay, maybe I won't bolt. <laughs> yeah, maybe. <clears throat> now, my, my <laughs> first business name, Skuru, was Silicon and Sorcery. <laughs> that, was my, that was my first uh, real-life shop, which was 50% Games Workshop Outrider Store and 50% PlayStation 1 because I'd just come out. Well, this is these are 5 plus intercepts, aren't they, at the moment? Unless he's, yeah, no one's tagged, so. Unless he's going to, yep, he's just going to do it, 5 plus intercept. Wow. Uh, wow. Who cares? Doesn't matter. Everything fine. Wow. I hate, I hate not tagging that intercept. But. Yeah, that is a pretty terrible name. No offense. <laughs> what, Silicon and Sorcery? Yeah, I was yeah. like 20. <laughs> yeah, no, they, it was, they I mean, hard. to be fair, it's a terrible name now. It was probably a lot better when I was 20. That's a long time ago. <laughs> uh, yes, I, I was going to say that now it's even much, much worse because, uh, well, things have changed. These, yeah, are, yeah. these are less innocent times. <laughs> But yeah, and also have to stop uh, mute the mic because after reading Escuro, assuming that it was Artemis. <laughs> you know, very optimistic Escuro, very optimistic. <laughs> so, Ar Artemis Blacks was my next, was the next business. That's how long I've been going. Carry on. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, Ali Red, or at least he knows his target market with that. <laughs> <laughs> my first shop almost got closed down because I duct taped the kid to the ceiling <laughs> I don't see anything wrong with that for cheating in, in 40k oh, wow. much better wow not for cheating for getting yes. caught no I'm not I still do have a shop <laughs> named Artemis Black Artemis Blacks plural but yeah Oh, well, that the blacks possessive, at the end. Possessive, it, it, possessive plural. Gives it the, you know, the sexiest at the end. <laughs> <laughs> this is tricky, isn't it? This was a really good... T to be fair, although he didn't tag with that, it's ended up obviously being a lot stronger that he was able to get lucky enough to avoid the 5 plus intercept. It's, uh, it's pretty strong now, isn't it? This is good. Yes, it's worked out d delightfully for him. Yeah. <laughs> Jim and Art stories about gaming shops. <laughs> I only really have the one good one. <laughs> but I had a customer, um, a I think he's about thirteen. I mean, if you've got a games workshop store, like there's loads of kids come in. So, like one of them was about thirteen, and he would come in about every two weeks, and he would buy some stuff. And sometimes he'd have a lot of money, and sometimes he'd have like a fiver or something. I just assumed he was from a family where, like, he got decent money for pocket money or something. And then this had been going on for months. And one week he came in and his mum was with him. And my, his mum told me the story that what would happen is he'd go and stay with his grandparents who owned a pub every two weeks for the weekend. And he'd rob the till. <laughs> <laughs> and would come to my shop and spend it. And she wanted me to give it all back. <laughs> and she brought his stuff, which was just half glued together and half painted like oh Eldar or whatever. And I was like, yeah, that's not how it works. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not giving you like a refund of the last six months because your kid is a fucking delinquent. That's amazing. <laughs> Absolute quality there. Absolute quality. <laughs> oh, meme. Holy shit. <laughs> oh, dear. Here we go. In comes the leap. The classic Edge 5 guy. Oh, he's rolled a 1. No re-roll for the hit. 
and only a push. I mean, he's made it easier for the Zons to score. Yep. <laughs> but the Witch Elf might be able to get round and do something. Oh, he's blocked his Witch Elf's way out. Oh, he's just realised. <laughs> <laughs> Fixed it. Amazing. <laughs> oh. Okay. Yep. Yes. Yeah. He could have. He could have blitzed from this square. That would have been much better. Yeah. Well, not much better. To be fair. Oh, he used his sure feet. Though he used his sure feet. There you go, there you go, uh, uh, Jim. You know nothing about this game. Three seconds, get our witch round you. Oh, oh he just dodged right through. Oh, okay. he ran out of time, is it? Shouldn't he have tagged? Uh, maybe he's not, actually. He dodged straight blitzer. through the double yeah. tackle zones. Yeah, well, he didn't have that much of a choice, did he? Because, I mean, I guess he did because he had the one square left. If he wasn't going to go, he should have known where he was going, shouldn't he? He was running out of time, but yeah. The obvious way was 3-2 out that way, wasn't it? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 to get there. Um, but he blocked that one with this one. He would not block the way out completely and had to dodge away. <laughs> Hmm. You could dodge the rackle around. No. And then just go for the score this turn. Yeah. He dodges the rackle around for even for a blitz because the ball carrier's guard. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Ugh. Double dodge, double GFI to push him backwards. Kind of annoying. I mean, he could one dice that uh, other lino out of the way. He gets a four plus. Doesn't have to yeah. double dodge or double GFI. Yeah, I think that might. Can be. he get someone? To, oh, can he? Oh, he doesn't have to one dice here. He can reach with uh, Roxy for an assist. He can two dice that uh, Lino on the left, and then dodge with the Rackler to push the the ball tag guard one back. Oh, yeah. and never mind. Roxy's just okay. going for a picnic somewhere. Okay. Everyone, lo everyone loves standing their best players <laughs> on their logo, don't they? Yeah. Oh, and there we go. And he's one dice there instead. Okay, I don't like that play. No. Now he's just going to do the double GFI without a reroll. That was not the correct play, sir. Um, I mean, he's got he's got to, hasn't he? I don't think this this is too much of the diamond tackle. Can't keep it safe. He's got yeah. it. He's got to just double. He's got to bang it in. He's got to bang it in. Uh, yeah. Got away with it. Yeah. Not, not what I would have done, because it was more shit. But it worked, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah. I mean, personally, I would have picked up the ball on my offensive drive. Yes. <laughs> we're, we're old school, Jim. <laughs> Out of touch with the, the new the younger new, the new generation of the gaming community. Yeah. yeah. The, the evolution of Blood Bowl. Yeah. Yeah. I've got a funny. I've got a funny story to tell you, Artemis. Uh, off stream. <laughs> off stream. <laughs> off stream. But yeah. <laughs> there you go. It's gonna be amazing, guys. A radio head one. <laughs> yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe. Zons. Zons will never win Chalice. They might this season, though. Baz is pretty good, isn't he? And he's got a Wizard and Roxy every match. Baz might win Chalice with Zons. No. Boy, howdy. I mean, he might, that's true. He uh, won't, but he might. Yeah, he might. <laughs> How many subs to tell Oh, wow, Volk, you big meanie. No, no amount, because I have integrity. There you go. I don't even know what integrity oh, wow. means. I integrity. just, I just know that Kurt Angle used to say intelligence 
integrity and intensity. <laughs> what if you say please? Oh yeah, okay, then I'll say it now. <laughs> Why are those two on the inside of the wide zone? Uh, then they have to go around now? Like, surely he's blitzing the, the wider son and going down the wing. That's what he should do, yes. He should check out the new... Step, so why the should, fuck aren't they over there? <laughs> he should check out the new uh, video that hasn't made yet, hasn't been made yet by Jimmy Fantastic called How to Score Against Chevrons. And what he would do is he would blitz the one at the back. Not the, Not whatever he's doing here. <laughs> I, I do particularly like the chevron on the right that just has a gap in the middle so it's not actually defending anything <laughs> the, ga the gap between the guy in the dead center and the chevron on the right is not, is not, it's just a straight gap so there's no reason for two of them to be over there well, I'm, I'm baffled what's that dodge guy doing? Oh, right, you mean on the offense? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, sorry, yeah. The, yeah the, the Dark Elves. Like, he's put yeah, two yeah. there, like a chevron, just like, you know, yeah. in case there's a blitz or whatever. Yeah. Was... They, they could just walk past him. He's yeah. not actually defended anything. Yes, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I was looking at these and I was trying to work it out. I'm like, how stupid am I being here? I can't... But yeah, this chevron, yeah, yeah. That was weird and I don't understand it. Okay, so he is going this way, just taking additional steps. <laughs> yes, yeah, just being slower for some reason. Why are, why are they... Oh, my days. <laughs> why isn't one of them over there so he can just, just run straight down the wing? I don't know. I don't know. Um, no, Volk, it isn't. <laughs> Flip me. He needs a little bit to not get surfed by Roxy here, doesn't he? So he They've all got sidestep. Oh, they've got sidestep. They've all got sidestep, so this is fine. All of them. <laughs> yep, yep, yes. this is fine. Look, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's what it is, Blob Skills McBlob, yep. That's the one. Shit kick for the Dark Elves, to be fair. It's kind of annoying. It is, yeah, but he's got kick. He's got kick, look. Uh, yeah. So it's 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 plus one for kick being a great game-winning skill. I actually like kick. I don't insult kick. No, it's, kick it's not, kick it's and kick-off return are in the same box of skills that people should take. It's not um, terrible. It's just... it's yeah. just The problem is, like, the opportunity cost, isn't it? And on don't, a, on don't a take your first line, skill... Yeah, don't take your first skill on a Wood Elf Catcher, like some pleb. Yeah, it's a Zon Line woman that's got a second skill, so what else is she going to take? She's always got Blodge. I'd take it on a, you know, on an Elf Lineman after Blodge. Fine. But I just hate it when people, yeah, just take it on, like, an Orc Lineman. It's like, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> is he going to go for the lob this turn? Might I guess that's what he's thinking it, about. Throw, he's thinking about throwing it to the edge. But I mean, the edge is not in scoring range, and when you fail. Yeah. But then if you put it into range, then. I just think you do it, right? I think you just get in scoring range and, uh, and pick it up. It can't be reached, right? All he's going to do is stay away from Roxy. Yeah. I don't know why he's not moving this guy, because this guy ain't doing for call, is he? He's just going to get in range. So he must be thinking about passing it. But you're getting closer next turn. I guess there's... If he fails the pass, though, Roxy's just nicking the ball. Whereas, yeah. like, if you do it next turn, that doesn't matter so much. But then it gives you two chances this turn. Like, if you do it this turn and fail, you get a second chance, don't you? But I think it's no. not worth it. No, because Roxy will have the ball. Well, she might not. She might <laughs> fail. He's going for the pass this turn. Yeah, yeah, he is, yeah. Just roll sixes, no problem. Yeah, Easy. Again, what do we know, right? Yeah. As well as you like. Ooh. Oh, what? Oh, I say, for some reason, he ran inwards, closer to the Rackler. 
And he could have just started here and gone one, two, three, four, yes. five, six, seven. <laughs> yeah. Well, this is the weakness. Like this is this is the weakness of the the what's it called, isn't it? The uh, chevrons here, because now all of a sudden this is pretty walled off. I mean, I I, I don't think chevrons is the right defense against this anyway. I think because you're just basically giving it up, right? Chevrons. Mm -hmm. There's no way that's not not getting through. Chevrons with like strength on the outside or stand firm on the outside. At least there's a shot. Yeah. Like this was just please run down one sideline. Yeah. Might as well have done slightly deeper chevrons and had players back to respond. Yeah. It's a good question. What would you do as an alternative, Artemis? Deeper chevrons. Just deeper, yeah. Because I'm slow, right? And then they, this is basically almost exactly what you could guess the position was going to be, assuming yeah. he didn't roll failures. So yeah. if you were two squares back, he can't be there. Yeah. So you would have probably have to sideline cage or something. Then you could maybe do something. Yeah, I do. I do not like this. Uh, maybe I do actually. Hitting Roxanne is pretty good, isn't it? But still, yeah, bang it in one one. And there is the Roxy one turn chance, and then there's the fifty fifty of to see who wins, basically, isn't it? If Bazza can pick up the ball. <laughs> yeah, there's no one turn. There's like 17 sidestep on the dark elf side. Oh, yeah, that's a good point. There's no one turn. <laughs> but there might be a Rondo Kaz on the, uh, on the one turn attempt. Hel yeah, Hellboy's... No, Hellboy's still got one. It's Bazza that's used his on that. Arch four. Like some people might not have put the, the sidesteppers on there to save them, or some people might have done something stupid and put the sidesteppers together. I've seen that way too often. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but Bazza's like a tabletopper, so this is no like his bread there. and butter. This is Hellboy, though, by the way. Oh, yeah, Bazza's the. Bazza's the, is the uh, Amazons. The Amazons, yeah. yeah. Sorry. Actually, no, Hellboy's a tabletop, it still works. Yeah, yeah Hellboy's a tabletop, yeah, so... It's, it's still the same thing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like they, yeah, the tabletoppers are just, in general, better than their equivalent level players of clatter format at one turns and stopping one turns. Yeah. <laughs> Bass is a tabletopper, so he'd never forget to pick up the ball. <laughs> Let's not get carried away. Oh dear. Yeah, because it's more, it's more win at all costs, isn't it, tabletop? That's the thing. Well, say tabletop, NAF-style tabletop events. Um, I mean, you like exposing his super blitzer on this side. Yeah, I don't like that. I think that's unnecessary. It's not necessarily true, Penamu, but like if you had two people of roughly the same skill, like so even like total penguins in NAF would be slightly better at one turns or stopping one turns than the equivalent penguin in Cladder because they just come up a lot more often in NAF format. Doesn't mean they're good, just means they they're better. Oh dear. Oh, touch back. What was the what was the kickoff thing? Oh, coaching. Yeah. yeah Someone just, got a reroll. Yeah. Well, he gets to hit some good players. <laughs> Classic gym <laughs> ruination. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect response by the game to him. <laughs> but at least that he, he has a chance of... No. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Amazing timing. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Who wins the toss? It's Hellboy. Welcome to Helf. The Rod Elfs. I think that spells the end for Baza. Without the wizard, I don't fancy his chances. Yeah, at all. this is not going to be easy. Exactly, Rolex. Yeah, it's brutal. Isn't it? It's just brutal. It's like you know, it's it's definitely. It, maybe it's com connected to my Twitch account and <laughs> rather than my Blood Bowl account. <laughs> Because I would have definitely made that LOS. A cheeky blitz, yeah, yeah, blitz, a blitz, and get it on Roxy and cage her up. Yeah, I don't really like it one forward the uh, the chevrons. Yeah, well, it it certainly looks now that that Zons are not winning this chalice, doesn't it? This looks like they're going out here, um, barring. Snakes or quads or some horrendous play. Blitz. Blitz, yeah. Blitz is the biggest one, I guess. So you, you just got to yeah, yeah. against Blitz. Got I mean, a, a Blitz and a shallow kick. Blitz and a deep kick probably does nothing. Yeah, but he's got kick, so... You should shallow kick for that reason. Quick score, it's overtime. Uh, well, so in this, just whenever you can. This is the thing, right? Elves can score whenever they want, so it's it's horrendous to try and defend. It's like you've got to constantly be defending against the quick score, which makes their long score easier, doesn't it? So the elves can just fanny around until... Something happens. <laughs> but yeah, I don't think they should like try and go down the side or anything. They should just protect against the blitz. Play safe. Strong and stable. And, uh, yeah, the Zons without a wizard don't really have anything other than red dice. Because it's going to be on the strand four guy. Yeah. The Dakar in overtime. Like maybe if somebody was on my... Big Shallow. Yeah. Riot. But not a blitz. That's what he needed last kickoff, wasn't it? it? Was the riot. And yeah, Hellboy could have even shifted more over at this side, right? Because that was the side with Roxy, so he could have maybe held the sideline with a sidestepper and, you know, put a bit more over on that side. Like two sidesteppers even, because Roxana was the big danger, wasn't it? With the blitz. There might be a deck in overtime. Like if it was a like a bit of a rubbish team, and you had somebody on one SPP away, then maybe you would deck it to try and get them there. Completion. <laughs> it's unlikely to, for someone to be that far ahead in overtime, but it's possible, isn't it? It's, it is possible that the team could be quite far ahead. Oh, okay. Roll some extra dice here. There you go. See, going for the going for the Dakar in overtime. The old overtime Dakar. <laughs> in MVP range. Wonderful. If he hands off back, it'd be amazing, wouldn't it? He just hands off back. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do five more completions. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna level this witch. <laughs> that would be amazing. Yeah. Carry on! <laughs> oh dear. It's gonna be amazing, guys! <laughs> There's some high high equity sound effects right now, isn't there? This LOS hasn't worked out completely amazing for him. Uh, true story, Dr. Feelsbad. I once scored on turn 24 in the cup because I spent the entirety of overtime trying to hand off to a chorf. <laughs> managing. That's, how, that's how little. Yeah, I did. Yeah, I, I scored on turn 24 with that chorf. Oh. 
I even handed off on turn 24 to him, <laughs> and I could have scored with the Hobgoblin who had the ball. <laughs> That's how little I cared about the cap. I was like, oh, I don't care. Fuck it, I'm going to level this job. <laughs> yeah, three words was really good, simply a sensei, but, but YouTube put C nut on the same level as bad words, so I don't want to it's, say it anymore. It's the only game I ever won, Trip, <laughs> with not with not boots. <laughs> yeah. Genuinely. Try, try the savage. <laughs> no penny with that that was a rebel story. That's that's the what kicked off the gigantic rebel discord hoo ha. Where I spent the entirety of overtime in a clan game, fouling a bull. Because <laughs> my I thought my opponent was a dick. A dark wing dacker. Um, yeah, well, probably what was wrong with it was him also being on stream saying bad things. No, I, I mean, other than, you know, are not I was annoyed because I thought my admin. opponent wasn't taking the game seriously because it didn't matter, his clan. Like, they, they, their team had already won, or our team had already won. And uh, my opponent was Wraithlord, the Xbox admin. Ooh. And he, he two-turned with Jorfs <laughs> to level a bull. <laughs> and which meant that, like, he was just going to lose 2-1. Like, and I was like... So he's not even taking this game seriously. So I spent the entire game trying to foul the ball that he'd leveled. <laughs> and because I'd failed, I, I, I purposefully didn't score and took it to overtime and kept fouling it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. It, it, it died on, like, turn 22, like, literally straight death. He had to delete his clan team. Oh, my God. That is amazing. That is amazing. That's proper uh, player versus player attitude. I respect it. That is amazing. I would have definitely just like only ever stunned him and got my whole team sent off or like, you know, badly hurt him or KO'd him, but that is amazing. Well done. Yes. Yeah, he literally had to use one of the weird clan powers to re-roll his entire team. <laughs> and uh, Tomidius, the only good player I've ever seen from Xbox, went batshit mental in the Rebel Discord. <laughs> claiming that I was like, you know, bad sportsman and stuff <laughs> and uh, and yeah I kicked off a gigantic argument with people coming out of the woodwork just wanting to insult me who I'd never heard of oh, amazing. some dude claimed I uh, like his his his, uh, his interaction with me was like so awful that it like scarred him for life or something Jeez. I'd never even heard of him I, ch I checked my discord <laughs> I'd spoken to him once about like eight months ago <laughs> Like for me, it was Tuesday. Like you know, for him, it was like the, the day that scarred him forever. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> He'd just been waiting that entire time. Like this is my time to tell my story. Yeah, it is funny. To be to be fair, like people do get offended at things and stuff sometimes, don't they? And you just, you just like. Mm. Sorry, I don't remember any of it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, Lehman, he was just rubbish. And apparently I I mentioned that. As I as I sometimes do. <laughs> oh, there's a Kaz. He was the opposing coach that won me a prize for most surfs in clan that's how bad he was wow. he was elves and i was dwarves and i won i got i surfed like seven elves <laughs> i probably spent the entire game laughing at how terrible he was Amazing. and then an absolutely grown man waited eight months to tell the world that he was upset <laughs> seems quite reasonable i don't see any problem with it <laughs> oh, if you got the power, he could have served, couldn't he? With the, uh, Absolutely the healthy attitude. <laughs> Carry on! <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
yeah, this random argument about about me fouling a ball just turned into people showing up going, I remember this guy from when he did this. <laughs> Toxic. Like, I don't remember you either. Like, I don't know any of you. <laughs> Someone brought up the bloody Kanor thing from the cross-platform cup. Oh, my God. I was like, it was literally like a weird greatest hits of Artemis. Like, <laughs> <laughs> went on for like an entire day. <laughs> Uh, the context of the Garion clip, Razzle, is if, if anybody's soft playing in Chalice or Ladder, if anybody isn't giving 100% effort or looks like they're grossly lacking, then you need to exclamation point Garion to alert him. <laughs> what with Garion being the only admin left? Basically, the others do do some things. To be fair, that's what I was told. I was told that the other people do something. Um, it's Elp Meme, uh, Razzle. That is Elp Meme. Carry on! <laughs> so, you know, like the perfect opportunity was when Bassett didn't pick up the ball on his offensive drive. <laughs> oh, and Luminous went the wrong way. <laughs> So we've had we've had a couple of examples of it already tonight. Carry on! <laughs> yeah, I've used it. I've used it to get it on, uh, properly. <laughs> it was exactly like that, Ali. Yeah. Every now and again, made worse by by me saying things like oh, I'd forgotten that. That was pretty funny. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Well, so now we've basically had a DACA, right? Like, he, this might as well have been a Dakar, um, yes. in which case he wouldn't have had taken two cars and he wouldn't have had this guy uh, niggled. But now we're at, we would be a Dakar with less space in behind, so less urgency to go through. But obviously he might as well go through because it's not going to get better than this, is it? So. Like, the deck is pretty pointless when you don't have to burn the half. <laughs> so, unless you're going to do a million passes. Amazing help. Yeah, like, it's not terrible or anything. You know, I'm not, I'm not slagging him off or anything. But, like, the, the point is, it, like, you know, obviously he might have got something. Obviously, this... The Dakar is good because it, it stalls the half out, doesn't it? And he didn't have to stall the half out because... If he scores, he wins. I don't know why he didn't just surf us on. I cannot answer you that, Lehman Ross. Yes, uh, like surfing is on w would mean this defense specifically is more difficult to keep up. Yeah. Like he, only needs, he only needs to remove two Zons and he, the Zons can't do it anymore. Yeah. Thank, thank you for doing it, Elmin, because it's it's a pretty great it's a pretty great sound effect. <laughs> In my opinion, but who can say if it's good or bad? Uh, now you were able to tell the chat that you have a girlfriend, Elmin. <laughs> Unless it means grandfather. <laughs> that gives me more sense, more sense. Living in the basement of your grandfather. <laughs> I, 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 to be fair, I got you. I got used to people saying "gf" meaning meaning grandfather because of uh, Diablo Two in it. Because that was that yeah. was one of the. Uh, well, El Mim, the you shouldn't be surprised of my dad leaving you. Everybody has done it, and with, with for good reason. <laughs> Yeah, it's, it is weird not going for the surfing tunnels. It, GF, BLGF is bad luck, get fucked, certainly. <laughs> Where did that come from, Try. <laughs> what the hell is this? Oh, 
Okay. Ja. <laughs> Very good, Skuro. <laughs> Humble filing can help me. Hellboy must be deep in thought or having a piss or something. Maybe he's Honestly, on help me. If if you showed me the position on turn on the first turn of this drive and then showed me the position now, I'd be like, what has happened? Yeah, I mean that would be my reaction as well, and I've been here. <laughs> I've got yeah, no how, idea. How would you happened. end up in this like shitty position? I don't know. I mean, I've seen it happen allegedly, but I've got no idea how it's happened. Is he just going to push over? Like, just push over to this side, maybe. Like, you don't need to get far into the half, do you? You could block there. And, uh, the problem is, you can't knock anyone down, can you? Dude, for fucking on. <laughs> well, he hasn't wanted to do that for some reason, so. Actually, to be fair, it's possibly a bit late to even bother now. Yeah, it is, yeah, yeah. But how does he even get forward, you know? Like, just, I guess just blitz. Probably still want to blitz one of these two and just get forward a little bit and then barrel forward the next turn, I don't know. Like, he doesn't have to get far forward, does he, with his movement A Double GFI. Indefensible character. Yeah. Like, it's not... It's not too difficult. If he just jams it's just, in. It's going in now, yeah. Yeah, just jam in. He only needs to get forward three. So. Jam in. Not oh, a very good jam in, to be fair. No. It's gonna. It's, it's probably gonna leave some kind of uh, possibilities open. Yeah. No, I don't like it either. But it's the problem of coming the previous five turns that I'll be honest, I haven't paid any attention to. <laughs> got, surely he's got to stick the. He should have stuck the diving tackle on someone to stop him from just freely moving around at some point. Yeah. There we go. Thank you. Oh, oh wait, oh, what? He dodged. Okay. Well, okay, whatever. <laughs> that might as well happen. Yeah, I mean, it's not like the Zons can really capitalize anyway, is it? They can just punch people. They can just punch people and see what happens. Maybe, like, they can... Uh, can they chain anything? No, not really. Not really. If he gets a power on that guard only... Um, Dark Elf. Would be nice. Yeah. I think the best he can hope is just to stop the score, isn't it? Like he's he's not gonna get he's not gonna be able to sack the ball and count or anything and so it's gonna be really hard. Like it's gonna be really hard, even if just like this potato, how do you even do anything? I don't think anyone has mentioned playoff nerves, no sick, but um, despite there being <laughs> some from Baza maybe with the uh, with not even trying to pick it up on the first turn. The problem is with pa I don't know that they can capitalize that much though, try because if they try to like do anything, then they're just sacrificing the defense. But then if they don't, their defense is worthless anyway because he's got fucking movement eight and edge five and leap so. It's it's definitely a, at least a bit tricky. Like this just isn't a defense, though, is it? The problem is that th this screen and everything is just pointless. It's just not a defense. Yeah, I would. I would like. I like trying it as well. Yeah, because this is too easy. But yeah, this is not a defense. I, I don't like the way. I don't like what Baz has done. Um, 
because yeah, it's not it's not good enough against Edge Five Leap. Like it just definitely isn't, is it? I mean, this isn't, but he can't score this turn. Yeah. But I mean, I just think he has to be on the same line as his forward elves. Just needs to be, just needs to be two forward from here, doesn't he? No, three. three yeah, he has to be. Oh yeah, yeah. One movement up, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he's actually. So the only way, the straight. only way to sort of be there is to have a base cage or no yeah. cage. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I think, yeah, no, I agree, try, I think, I think, even though he's got to have a base cage, I think it's going to be enough. Yes, I think so too, he should have fought harder that turn to push in or punch some people. Yeah. To stop that, because, I mean, that that is all he has to do, he's only got two turns left, so he has to be in scoring range this turn. Should have moved the ball carrier first, in case this was quads. <laughs> I don't know where the ball guy is going. I assume it's going between yeah. those two guards. Yeah. 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 It's definitely going there. It has to. I mean, I guess it could go one forward, but that's a bit rowdy, isn't it? Ah, so maybe it could go one forward. Yeah. Yeah, it could go one forward. Why not? Oh. It's got the safety. Deep safety. Stand on the logo. That's the key. That's a proper square. That's a pro square. <laughs> There's been an awful lot of standing on the logos. Roxana did it last half, didn't she? And then obviously Luminous was obsessed by it. Oh my god, he's just what? He's what? just is he just potatoing with the ball, yeah? He's potatoing. What? Wow. What I mean uh... What? What? I was a little distracted, but... Uh... No, you've got to go here or here, haven't you? Like, you, you could go one forward. You can go here or here. But that's, you can't go there. That's mad. I think he's uh, regretting it already. He's, just got, he's got to dodge through now to protect it. Yep. And he's made it. Right. Sorry. I'm sorry. Um, soft play in Chalice. <laughs> Shit play in Chalice. <laughs> oh, Ooh, Pops Dodge. Doesn't matter. Oh, that again. was a little too greedy there. Oh. Right, can he get TD? I think so. Yeah, he's, he's got he's got strength Enough three guard, rackle, right? hasn't he? He's got strength three rackle. He's got a guard there. He's got a guard here. He can double tackle. GFI to avoid the dark elf guard here. if he doesn't have to, if he doesn't have enough guards to counter. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So yeah, I think he, I think he, yeah I think he can put two guards in and double GFI to two dice. Maybe, and then Roxy can recover. Well, he's used one guard. He's got a punch to try and free up this guard, hasn't he? Oh. Because of the diamond tackle. A sidestep trip. So I don't think so. Don't think he's got enough. Yeah, no, he definitely can't surf it. That's not definite. I mean, he could fill in the the uh, two above and two below with the with Zons. <laughs> it's pretty fucking hard to fill the two above it's, and two below, isn't it? It is a diamond of tackler. Yeah. Oh, the diamond tackler. Yeah, okay. Fair <coughs> enough. Diamond tackler fucks it. Yeah. I think. Uh, I guess he has to give up on the Roxy. Uh... No, he can't. Uh... How the fuck do you get Roxy through so to Ro the? Roxy can leap, can't she? Somehow. Um... Come round and leap into the square on the sideline. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. Being assists because you want to also blitz from one of those squares, one from the top left. Yeah, yeah. So, so you've got one, two, three, four, five. And just need a leap. Just need a leap. Just one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, right? Yeah, the diving, the diving tackle is what fucks it, trip. But otherwise, yeah, yeah, yeah. you could have saved it. 
Yeah, 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 yeah. If there's diamond tackle, yeah, totally you make those one in nines. But you can't, you can't do. Oh my god, no! You have Going to for get a 1D. the assist. You have what? to get the assist from Roxy, don't you? You have to, surely. Gets, gets it with gets the one D. But now, obviously, Roxy gets the recovery, so it's fine. Yeah, I mean, that's what was the original plan, right? When he tried to power the diving Ooh. tackle. Yes. Because yeah. then he could have brought that guard up from below and. Yeah, I mean, obviously having Roxy for recovery is better, but I think also not failing is better. But um, I'm not sure it's better to 1D. I, I would have rather made it 2D. But now obviously this is better because you've got Roxana. Yeah, the ball and then 13, 14, 15. That one could be a, oh, that one could have been a scoring threat. Oh, man. This one can. Yeah, so you, can dodge, you can dodge the catcher. Yep. Oh man, this would be crazy, wouldn't it? This would be good. So now he's looking a genius bringing back this witch shot. Well, not really, because <laughs> still got I a mean, removing the, removing the strength for leapers, we didn't mention it. Like, it's pretty fucking amazing for this. Yes. Yeah, for not getting scored on. Yeah, for him not re sacking the ball. Yeah. Yeah, very hard. A very difficult ball sack now. Oh, made it. Yeah. Did <laughs> he? Nice. So now, yeah, I mean, uh, all you can do really is tag that if, you, if you're if you going to try and score and sack the ball because you're going to use yeah. your blitz up there. Yeah. But maybe you don't. Maybe, okay, well, he's not he's not punching. I would have maybe punched her and given up on the score. Because <laughs> this looks a really hard score, doesn't it? Like, I don't even know what you, how yeah. you even it, go about this it. Is, this is a really hard score, yeah. Yeah, I would have just, just punched this. I would have definitely punched that with a witch. Well, not really, because I wouldn't have tatoed <laughs> the previous turn. That was a wild one, wasn't it? Wow. How are you? What? Is this, it's just 1D on Roxy with this uh, 3 plus, 4 plus. And failed the first dodge anyway. Well, free roll score attempt. Don't re roll shit, obviously. Except maybe like the GFI at the end or something. Yeah. I can be a Hail Mary Maybe. Pass add, add five. Pass. Yeah. Oh, he's already Ooh. blitzed. I was thinking maybe you uh, maybe you like do all these dodges and GFIs to blitz the witch and you you know just see if it works and then like without rerolls and then if then you're more likely to use a reroll on the other bits. The blitz through the witch. Yeah, could have done, but it's gone now, isn't it? He's getting proper in his own way here. Take a block. It's not really going to hail Mary Pass. Oh my god. Oh god, he is. Well, no, it's just an arch fall. But that's worse, isn't it? Isn't that Yes, worse? that's got to be worse. Like, I'd, I'd rather just leap with Roxana. And then you oh, get they... exactly the same place. She has pass. Oh, she has pass. Yeah, oh, she has she pass. Yeah. Okay, fair And she's enough. got catch hey, and she's whoa. caught it. Oh my god. In your face. I mean, you've oh, got to re roll this now. Oh, she had dodge. Wait. She had tackle. Yeah. He didn't re-roll it. Didn't re-roll it. Wow. Wow. Wow, I think I think he probably I think that was a decent Imagine uh, how good that would have been if you had not wasted the blitz just randomly doing something yeah, up there. Yeah, I'd, I'd hate wasting the blitz. Okay, we kick it here, fifty percent. Right. Hello yeah. game, here we go. Boosh. Absolutely unexpected. What a surprise! Yep. Yeah. Super G Big uses blitz. So yeah, I didn't. I didn't like using the blitz before. That player was too too good, wasn't it? The witch arm. Here we go. So these are the two, the two guaranteed scores because of the rerolls. Very exciting. 
I can't believe they wasted time animating these. <laughs> yeah. Still don't uh, I only have one chainsaw. <laughs> That's true, Basil, yeah. yeah. Oh, the Dark Elves have scored. Ooh, now time for the Amazons. There you go, the Dark Elves did not roll a one. <laughs> That's how that works. Demi, don't look now. Oh, Amazons will never win, Chalice. Amazons will never Amazons win. Amazons can draw the one. That. <laughs> <laughs> well, there you go. What an amazing overtime uh, that real, was. Real fast. Yeah, that was that was something from Hellboy the Potato. At least he made it interesting. <laughs> Yeah, congratulations, Hellboy. Commiserations, Bazza. Thank you very much, Fymir and Artemis. It's always a pleasure to be here. And uh, thanks, for, <laughs> thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.